So this is a book a friend gave me when I had one of my little baby monsters. It's called Introductory Calculus for Infants. Calculus is a kind of math. It's by Omi M. Inoue. The storybook adventure of two friends as they discover the wonders of calculus. So there's crayons and an X and an F. Green crayon, red, blue, pink, yellow, blue. All right, let's try it out. Introductory Calculus for Infants by Omi M. Inoue. And again, I'm probably saying it wrong, I apologize. Dedicated to Cassandra, Zoe Miles. Cassandra, you have a mother who fearlessly dances with fire and a father whose work has been buried under the ocean and may soon be shot into orbit. There is no limit to what you can learn from them. This book is for entertainment purposes only. The author is not a professor and is not qualified to teach anyone anything. I don't know about that, but all right. Introductory Calculus for Infants. How colorful. A. This is A. Many things start with, whoops, the letter A. Apple. It's a red apple. Alien. Ooh, it's a purple and blue an alien with a blue dress. Astronaut. Ooh, he's pointing to the alien because he's going to the space. This book. A. This is A. You are here. <laughs> Oop. There are lots of other letters and lots of words start with them too. So B for butterfly and B and ball, bzz, bzz. C for crayon and cat and car, D for duck and domino and dime, E whoop. for egg and elephant, etc. X. This is X. Not very many words start with X. Oop. It's a xylophone. Boom, 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 boom. I don't think X likes that he's less popular, potentially. Many of the other letters were mean to him. Aww. You're boring. That's so mean. Nobody likes you. Oh my goodness, poor X. This is F. She is fabulous and fun. Ooh, and there's flowers and fireworks. She didn't like the way the other letters treated X. You're not being very good friends. That's what she's saying to M here. One Friday, F went over to X's house. Want to play with my Xenon? Ooh, that is a guess. Uh, no thank you. See, that's what you say if you don't want to do something. Be polite. Let's be friends. You don't want to be my friend. I'm no fun. You can be fun if you want to be. With me by your side, you can be anything. Ooh. You can be absolute. So, F to X is an absolute X. You can be boundless. So f of x couldn't equal x to the third. That's what that means. Looks like she's climbing up with climbing gear. That's fun. You can be convex or concave. Oh, look at this one. It's f of x. 
So the square root of r squared minus x squared plus r. So here's c over here looking a little bit down. You can have a derivative. That's a math term. Convex and concave have to do with the direction. So convex means it curves away. Concave means it curves inward. Oh, look at all of this fun. This is a, this is a lot of math. I'm, I'm not going to read this one aloud, but that's a, a derivative as a way to, uh, to break things down. And that's a little chart there. You can be exponential. Oh, so e to the x. The poor e is falling down. Look how functional we are together. Oh my goodness. I, I don't know how functionable they are, but sure. Cool. It's a function. You can have global extrema. I'm probably saying that wrong. Global maxima, global minima. Wee. So f to the x is 3 is sine of the x. Or be hyperbolic. Wee. The little h is looking a little nervous there. I can see most of the letters are looking a little unhappy. Look at the g. <laughs> f to the x of 1 over x. You can be irregular. Well, this makes no sense. Who knows <laughs> what's going on here, but I seems interested. You can jump from one spot to the next. Ooh, there's a little trampoline. Boom, boom. And the J has got a little pogo stick. So he's jumping. So look, so F of the X of three is if X is less than one and one if X is greater than one. Okay, so that's how that works. You can be the king of knowledge. Oh, look at all of this math. And look, the, the K is a jester. Oh my goodness. Poor jester. Or you can be the natural logarithm. Get off my line, Ellen. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, you're so funny. Whee. You don't have to be mean to have a mean. Oh, look at that grumpy M. Yeah, mean is a kind of way of averaging something. I'm not gonna really explain that. You can be an nth degree polynomial. That is one way to get an N. So here's a little N. Oh, he's like, oh, look at all those colors. He's all rainbowy. How fun. You can be one to one. Look at that. <laughs> or you can be a parabola. Whoop. Ah, that shape's called a parabola. Oh, the P looks unhappy about this, this jump rope here. You can visit all the quadrants. See the Q? One, two, three, four quadrants. Oh no, it's an expired passport. Expired. Poor Q. Looking a little, little down. You can model regression. So that's the nice little symbol down here. Oh, we're all the way to S. You can have a slope. Or you can be tan. Oh, that's funny. A little joke with the sun. Tan has, is a math term too. Not just how you get with the sun. It looks like poor T has a sunburn. Needed to have some sunscreen. You can represent... A uniform distribution. Oh, you looks a little unhappy down there. And you'll always pass the vertical line test. 
I'm not sure exactly what that test is, but we'll see. Here it is. We got an A+. Plus. Oh no, the V has an F. He did not do well on that test. You get to wiggle all over the place. Look at it, wiggle, 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 wiggle. You can always be yourself. So the function of X to X. Doop, doop. X. All right, we're almost to the end of the alphabet. You can intercept Y. Oh no, they got paint on Y. Not cool, guys. And they're painting different things here. It's a cosine. And you can have zero crossings. So function X positive, function of X negative. It says stop. Whew. I like that he looks kind of like a watermelon with the green and the orange and the pink. Wow, I can be anything. You're my best friend, F. Yay, let's draw Gaussians together. I think that's how you say that. Oh, they're drawing them. Oh, that's paint brushes. Okay. Oh, look, he wants to play. Can I play too? Oh, they're looking at each other. I wonder if they're going to let Z play. What do you think? It says, we can have a Z axis. Ooh, so they have the X and the Y, or it was the other way around. But um, one of those is X, one of those is Y. Or have dim any dimension in real space. Oh, look, D and R can come play. We can have multiple parameters. Oh, yay, M and P can come play. They're so happy. Or we can be a unit circle. Oh, good. U and C and is that O can all come play too? Because O is a circle. And all the letters saw that X really could be anything, including a great friend. Oh, look, they're all having so much fun right now. So K is the king again. And P is jumping on that rope. And N is rainbowy again. Oh, there we go. Here's a special thing and some references. All right, so really, even though it's introductory calculus, it's also the alphabet. All right, I hope you had fun. Don't to worry too much about the math. It's just showing you that concepts can be fun. And X can be anything. Well, I hope you had fun. Thanks so much for listening. You have a great day.